Okay, let's go in here and see if we can take off the bounty on me. Oh, I'm so sorry. Nobody. Watch your stare. I'm sorry. Pay bounty. I don't know whether to be impressed or frightened. I'm gonna pay all of them. I don't have 300 bucks though, but that's okay. It is what it is. They got that whole town on lockdown. Hey! What did I do? Put that down. This is a robbery. Oh, it's a robbery. Now. Open the damn you register. To be approved, you'll have all the money. Stay away from me. I can't believe this is happening. It's fine. Thank you very much, sir. 21 bucks. That wasn't worth it. Hold up. We got to take care of this quietly. Who, who in it? Oh, yeah, there's a window right there. <laughs> no one saw that. No one saw that. No one saw that. Oh, my God. We're so dead. Uh, still searching for me, though. This man's coming on the pathway. They don't waste an ammo though, that's, that's the problem. Oh my god, you got a shotgun, bro. Time to go. Time to go. Oh. Never mind. <laughs> I jumped into the water and died. Jail, oh my god. Ow. Yep. Yo. Hello, sir. I've, uh, I've come from Blackwater. I'm on the trail of a dangerous gang. Dangerous. Como Driscoll. Dangerous. You had some sort of incident. We don't deal with bounty hunters around here, son. I, I was just wondering if I could get a description. Well, they weren't friends. Mm -hmm. Got in a fight, two men got killed. Now, one of them's an idiot, the other's some kind of dumb mix, so maybe them's your boys. Maybe. You can look right it's raining now. When we hang them. Why would you want to hang them? Why would you want to do that? I think my mouth is too close to the mic. Ooh. It's raining out here, bro. I like it. Hello, old friend. Had a good time, did you? <laughs> yeah. You going to get me out of here? Am I? I ain't decided yet. Real funny. Oh, I ain't joking, cowpoke. Yeah. I heard so much bluster out of your mouth these last six months. And now, I got an opportunity to watch you be silenced. That is but true. You gotta do something. Why? I always looked up to you, Arthur. Well, that's your first mistake. It is your first mistake. Listen, that was a terrible thing problem. you should have done. Should have said. There's only one of me, and there's a whole town full of people mm -hmm. wanting to see you swing. You Swinging. got to do something, Arthur. What am I going to do? Maybe that steam donkey over there still works. Maybe. Maybe. Yes, I do. Hold up. Dynamite. We got some dynamite. You might want to step back a bit. Yep, I want to step back. It's going to be a little crazy. There's two. There's a guy. <laughs> Only new one. Dynamite OP. Watch out. Won't it? Dead or alive? Let's get out of here. Come on. Let's go. Wait a what minute. Are you doing? He wasn't O'Driscoll. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Fuck that guy. Oh, my head's like going down. Shit. Can you hold the hell still? Thank you. Pull up and reload it. It's on my banana. Don't go that way. Let's get the hell out of here. I got some unfinished business. Trust me, Morgan. Trust you? You have finally lost your damn mind. Keep moving, Arthur! God damn maniac! Hold up. Picking up something. That's not what I wanted. What want I thought it was a gun there, damn it. Uh, I thought that was a gun there. Go well. still, sir. Okay, there we go. Anyway. 
Bad idea, but whatever. Here it is, right here. Pick up that thing right there. Pick it up, fool. Pick up the gun, fool. Thank you. Don't give up on me now. Oh, right in the face, bro. This is that good. Let's we really go. should get out of here. Where are we going? Yourself, Making a house like call. I said, I need, need bullets. Skinny, get out here. Who the heck's skinny? Pull up. I need bullets. Okay, you keep doing your thing. I'm getting bullets. Don't mind me. It ain't skinny. My guy is Norman. It ain't oh. Norman. Crap. That's right. Excuse me, man at Arthur. Okay. There's gonna be a lot of there's gonna be a lot of blood in there. Oh, I got 134 bullets. Oh. Oh my god. They had something of mine. My guns. I showed Fair. him. And I'll show the rest of this town. That's right. Really lost it this time. Ah, yeah, he went a little too far this time. That's a horse. We don't shoot horses. What are shooting me? I don't leave loose ends. We about to. There's a dude up there. You're good. You're good. You're good. Reckon it's time we got out of here, Morgan. Now you want to get out of here? Boom. There we go. Let's go. That person's being dragged. Okay. Don't have much choice. I like the rain though. It looks nice. Nice shot. Got your back. Oh yes. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my goodness. That's lightning right there, boys. That's how you do it. Whoa, I didn't get a picture of it though, damn it. I think we finally lost. Well, I hope damn so. <laughs> I'm giving you a holster. It's my way of saying thank you. And thank you. A holster? There I was having a dull day only for you. To liven it up by letting me help you shoot up <laughs> half a town. You're a funny fellow, Arthur. Real funny. Thank you. Why you act all sour all the yeah, time? Yeah, well, you ain't funny at all. So why you gotta act like the court chest? Right, listen. I'm sorry, but we're family now. Arthur, you and me. Sons of Dutch makes us brothers. Right, as long as you ain't gonna be no dick. Brothers make mistakes. That is true. I'm heading back to my little camp where I'm back of Strawberry. Okay. Come see me. Maybe I can make things up to you. You ain't heading back to Dutch? No, I've been a bad boy, Arthur. I ain't seeing Dutch till I can bring him a peace offering. Okay, that's fair, yeah. Hello, sir. I'm looking for, I don't even know what I'm looking for. Oh, go hunting. Yo, let's What'd go hunting, Charles. For? The greatest of gifts. You know, Hell yeah. Stagecoach. No, you simple-minded fool. Simple-minded fool. Bison. Bison? Bison. Bison. From which you can get anything. There's some over on the plains, I believe. I saw a couple a long way off. Oh. Right? Oh. Good luck. Get some you bison, bro. I'll show you how we hunt one. Sure. Why not? Let's go. Let's go get some bison, bro. All right, let's go, mister. We about to, we about to get some bison. Whoa. You better run. That's right. You ain't running nowhere. Well done. <laughs> Thank you. Sorry, right, Bison. All right. Skin and butcher. Take the horns too. How do I do that? It can all be used. Oh, okay. Hello. There we go. Sorry, right, Bison. You look like a nice animal. Oh, okay. Relax. Oh yeah. A lot of skin right there. Oh, we're actually gonna. We're actually taking the horns. Oh my god. Okay. 
Now what? It's a daisy. Good job. What about all this meat, though? Stow that on your horse and mount up. Don't okay, but what about all the meat, though? Oh, what happened over no. here? Look, bison shot and left for dead. It looks like. Why would they do that? Why would someone do that? Why would they do that? I don't know, but I see tracks heading in this direction. I say we follow them. You gotta, you gotta, all right. you gotta use way. all the material, bro. Look at that. It's just a waste of freaking meat and stuff. Did you fools shoot those bison? What's your problem? I said, did you fools shoot those bison? Calm down, you black or red bastard, whatever the oh. fuck you are. Did you shoot them? Yes, we did. We shot them bison. We'll shoot you too if you don't get. What business is it of yours? What? We. Oh, whoa, whoa. It's that business of mine. Good God, you're crazy. I got a family. A family. Don't shoot me. It's Stand true. Back, Charles. I'll get you some answers. I like giving what answers. What the hell are you doing? What am I doing? Shut Why up. Are you killing those bison yeah. and them to rot? Yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. God Shut damn up. It, tell us you're dead. You're going to die, sir. You no, better okay. tell me. We were paid to kill as many as we could and make it look like it was Indians. Just oh. kill him, Arthur. No. Please. Nah, I ain't gonna kill him. Right. I ain't now gonna kill him. Just, don't, don't shoot me, mister. I got a family. I ain't gonna shoot you. Run away. Why did you do that? What do you mean? He didn't need to die. Maybe he'll go tell his friends now what happens to poachers. Yeah. I've seen enough of this. I'm heading back. You want me to kill him? I can kill him right now. Okay. I got I'm him in my sights. If there's anything worth taking from their camp, I'll catch up with you later. There we go. Yeah, bye bye. I, I killed him. You're welcome. Not too busy. What? I heard about a house. It could be interesting. What kind of a house? Buy a house? I don't know. A couple fellas I heard in town, they said said it was really freakish. A family local boogeyman, I guess. Oh. But they're crooked in every way. So? Well, so these boys thought they were sitting on a lot of cash. And they're highway robbers, kidnappers, apparently. They're well hidden in the woods. That sounds pretty dubious. Of course, uh, yeah, it's dubious, but there ain't much risk of getting caught. That is true. Okay, Other than death, but I mean, let's go take a look. It's still fine. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Just take a look. Yeah, let's go take a look, bro. Well, there's a pretty big barn in the back. It's not a bad place to start looking. There must be a lot of people living here. It's a large house. It's Must be. be in any one of them buildings, and who knows how many people are in there. That is true. <clears throat> it could be a lot. Sure about this. Boy, I, I think we need to draw them out somehow. And I got an idea. Follow me. Okay, this this is a very terrible idea though, but I will do it. Don't see what my head. Out of here? What okay. are we doing? You take over by the rock over there. I'll create a little distraction, and then you jump them. Okay. Okay. What kind of distraction? Fire right there. That's a fire. That's a damn fire right there. Oh my god. This is, I don't know if this is a good idea. This is crazy. I'm crazy, bro. There's a random fire over there. Oh my god. What the hickory happened here? I don't know, man. Oh my god. We got hellfire. Defend your soldier. Boom! Right in the back of the neck. You That's right. Are you dead? Missed. Right in the horse. Right in the head. Okay. Where's this guy? Where's this guy? Upstairs. Upstairs. Boom! Right in the face. Boom. Let's look for the stash. They okay. weren't shy about defending that barn. Let's check in there first. Yeah, let's check in here first. Let's push this out of the way. <coughs> oh, yeah. Oh, well. Look at that. Look what we have here. Look at that. Nice. I told you it was worth the trouble, didn't I? Yeah. You take this. You take that. Let's split up. I'll meet you back at camp. Nice. Sounds good. 
You better put that half of that in the thing though. Or else. John. John. What are you doing over here? What do you want? Uncle told me something about a train. Oh, there we what go. Yep. Say? Mary Beth overheard something about a train full of wealthy folk rolling down through Scarlet Meadows just mm -hmm. south of the state border. Mm -hmm. Yes. Need help with it? I ain't even sure about doing it. Come on. At night, not too guarded, it's perfect. Nah, I ain't thought it through. You know, stopping a train, pain in the ass. Sure. Yes. But what if we could force a train to stop? <laughs> well, of course. We get a wagon full of something flammable, oil. Put it on the tracks. They see it. They know they either have to stop or die. Stop and die. The train driver wants to be cooked alive. Ooh. That is kind of brilliant. Kind of brilliant. Uh, for you. <laughs> and that is a real idea. I think that's the first time you ever had one of them. Hey, Shut good up. ideas. You what are you might about? be the first bastard to ever have half his brains eaten by a wolf and end up more intelligent. So we're doing it? Yeah, we're gonna need ammunition, guns, look real frightening, and mm. some dynamite to open up dynamite. the Dynamite. I'll get the supplies. Gotta head into town for Abigail anyway. Don't even ask. You go find us an oil wagon. Yeah, I know just the place. They're always heading into that refinery. Yep. There's an old rundown shack just over the border, north of a place called Dewberry Creek. Leave it hidden somewhere near there. All right. Do that. Yo. You shoot that, we gonna explode. You crazy sons of bitches. Oh, that's a swamp. That's a swamp. All oh, right there. Oh my god. Or oil. That's not even swamp. That's oil. Just straight oil. I'm getting away, bro. Stop shooting the oil. I'm shooting the oil, dummy. You want that? I mean, it's <laughs> the oil leaking now. God dang it. Do I just leave it here? Perfect. There you go. Good horse. There you go. Have a carrot. Never mind. No carrots. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, well, the thing is in the thingy. John. John. Let's get on. Good. Down the thing you? is in the tank. Got everything we need. Good. I think we need another man. Charles. I'll go get him. Meet us at the wagon when you can. Okay. Sure. Really? See, Arthur. Ain't that dumb. <laughs> Next time, let the wolves eat all your brain. Then you'll be a genius. Hi, Arthur. Come here a minute. I probably have to oh, actually go back out there <laughs> after all that. <laughs> Can I ask you a favor? Fisher of me. not. Very funny. Would you do something with Jack? He seems kind of down. All this upheaval can't have been easy on the poor kid. <sighs> Why? Because I'm your preferred nursemaid? What the hell? Do what you say. Please. <sighs> okay. I'll take him in the morning. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. Go to Jack. Yo, Jack. Time to wake the hell up. Let's go. What you up to? Playing. Anything fun? I guess. Yes, that's you true. You want to come fishing with me? Ooh. Fishing? Hell yeah. Sure. You're... <laughs> it's about time that you started to earn your cape. Yep. Okay. Good. Let's go get your pole in. Now, you do have a fishing pole, don't you? I sure do. Good. Uncle Jose made me one. Nice. Good. Well, let's go get it then. Let's go, go get catch it. Us some fish. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You can't fish without a pole. I got a pole First, right here. Look at this. Oh, Dale. <laughs> we need some bait. Can you bite it? There we go. There we go. Well, it seems like he's taking a rest now. I'm going to try reeling him in nice and steady. You rest. Hey. Look at that fish. Wham. This one's a chain picker. Not bad. Hey. Pick up my hey, bait. look at this. <laughs> And what? This necklace I made. Necklace? For Mama. Ooh. What a fine young man. Who the hell are you? And in such complex circumstances. Mm -hmm. Arthur, isn't it? Arthur Morgan? Who are you? Yes. Arthur Morgan. 
Vanderlyn's most trusted associate. Mm -hmm. You've read the files. Typical case. Orphaned street kids seduced by that maniac silver tongue and matures into a degenerate murderer. Oh, yeah. Agent Milton. Okay. Agent Ross. Pinkerton Detective Agency. Seconded to the United States government. Uh huh. Nice to finally meet. We know a lot about you. Do you? You're a wanted man, Mr. Morgan. It's $5,000 for your head alone. $5,000? That is a lot of money. Me? Can I turn myself in? We want Vanderlyn. <laughs> Old Dutch. I haven't seen him for months. That's so. Because I heard a guy fitting his description robbed a train belonging to Leviticus Cornwall up near Granite Pass. Oh, oh ain't that a little old-fashioned nowadays? Apparently not. Listen. Mm -hmm. I'm this listening. This is my offer, Mr. Morgan. Yep. Bring in Vanderlyn. Uh -huh. Have my word, you won't swing. Okay. Oh, I ain't gonna swing anyways, Agent uh, Milton. You see, I haven't done anything wrong. Yep. Aside from not play the games to your rules. Spare yep. me the philosophy lesson. I've already heard it from Mac Callender. Mac Callender? Mac Callender. He was pretty shot up by the time I got to him. So really, it was more of a mercy killing. Slow. But merciful. Hmm. <laughs> you enjoy being a rich man's toy, dear. I enjoy society, flaws and all. You it's people linked. venerate savagery, and you will die savagely. You won't bet. All of you. You won't bet. We're all gonna die, Agent. Mm -hmm. Some of us sooner than others. Good day, Mr. Morgan. Good day. Goodbye. Goodbye. Enjoy your fishing, kid. While you still can. <laughs> hmm. Who are they? Uh, buttholes. No one to worry about. No one at all. Come on. Let's pick up your things and get home. How you boys get home? Great. We caught a fish and yeah. I made you this necklace. Thank yeah. You, lady. Hey, real pretty. The luckiest. Did you thank Uncle Arthur? No need. We had a good time. Yeah. What's wrong? Nothing. Just met some folk. I better go speak with Dutch. Okay. Hey. Okay. You did real fine, kid. Thanks. You're welcome. We got a problem. What? I just met some guys out near the river. A fella named, uh, um, Milton and, uh, I don't remember the other fella's name. Ross. Milton and Ross. And, Milton and Ross. And they are employees of the Pinkerton Detective Agency. And they okay. know about the train and they know we're here. Were you followed back here? No. They know we're near here. And they want you, Dutch. They offered me my freedom in exchange, they did. Mm -hmm. Why didn't you take it? <laughs> Very funny. Very funny. Well, what do we do now? I say we do nothing. Just yet. Just yet, that's true. Just trying to scare us into yep. doing something stupid. Yep. We have turned a corner. We survived. Them mountains. Mm -hmm. We just need to stay calm. Yep. That's it. Okay. <laughs> he just just going. Okay. <laughs> so I'm taking six shots all straight to the face. I'm taking six shots. Are you coming with me? I'm taking six shots, yeah, straight to the face. And I run again and I said I'm sick.